Hey guys, I'm Dr. Mitchell and welcome back to another episode. Today we're going to be talking about Omnichroma. It's a universal shade composite for fillings. So I'm going to show you how it's used, what it's used for, my results with it, and what I think of the product. So first we're going to be shooting some b-roll for our website, so come hang out. Chroma for two class threes to close a black triangle between number eight and nine on my boy Victor. Victor, what do you think of them? Let's see. I think it works really well. You think the color is good? Yeah, I can't even tell. Okay, guys, so I'm going to be talking about Omnichroma. Omnichroma is a universal shade composite, meaning you don't have to pick the color for your fillings. Normally, we have to use this shade guide and find the color that best matches the patient's tooth and then find the corresponding composite. So the problem is you gotta keep all of these in stock. Omnichrome is supposed to be that one solution um, so that you don't have to keep everything organized and in stock and that kind of thing. So when you open the packaging, it's pretty cool, a little box here. Uh, it says it uses their smart chromatic technology to get that one shade fits all, especially for their class threes and class fours. Um, you know, when I use this Omnichroma, the first time I pulled it out, my first impression was is how short this little nozzle is. You guys see that? Pretty short. When you when you're looking at like the 3M fill tech, they designed their cartridges so that it's a lot longer. See how much longer that is compared to the Omnichroma side by side. Omnichroma fill tech. This is gonna be really helpful when you have like a deep class two and you want to get that all the way down in there without having to condense as much. Um, it makes your life a lot easier to have that longer nozzle on the cartridge for the composite. Omnichroma also says that, you know, the bigger the bevel, the better it's going to blend. And that's kind of with any composite, but you know, it works pretty well as you can see in these photos on this class five I did on number 30. I think it came out pretty well. Now, when you look at this class three, I did kind of a no prep situation where I didn't want to prep it. It's a buddy of mine. Um, and we we're just kind of testing the waters to close that black triangle he has. You can see here on the class twos that I did, it works really well. I really like the viscosity of this material. It's very manipulative. You can move it around easy. It's unlike the Venus. The Venus is kind of like working with dry clay. I'm really not a fan of Venus, but you know, it gets the job done. On a radiograph, Omnichroma kind of looks natural. In enamel, it's kind of look like Emacs on a radiograph, which I really like. I like that natural look. Some people like to go that really radiopaque look, just, you know, because it looks clean. Um, I would recommend it. I think it's a great solution for a one shade fits all composite. Obviously, it's not gonna be as accurate as if you pick the individual shade for each filling you're doing, but like I said, it's a great solution to not have to keep track of 20 different shade colors for your composites. Well, that's it, guys. Hit the like button and subscribe. There's more to come. Thanks.